Um, pitching is a, is, is a really interesting uh, uh, aspect of, of film writing um, because you need to go in and, and talk to, if it's a feature, you're going to talk to um, a studio person or a producer. And um, uh, or in television, you're pitching to against a, a network or a studio, and tell them basically what you want to write. And you, to me, I, I consider it a performance. And I don't mean you stand up and act out all the parts. There are some writers that I, I believe do that. Uh, it's not me, and I think it's most writers aren't. But the extreme other side of that is writers who go in and kind of mumble through it, and you know, kind of don't look look people in the eye and all that. And you really have to be prepared to. You want to try to get the um, the person listening to understand your passion for the idea, why it's, why it's there's you have a passion for it, and transfer as much of that to them as possible. Again, in a in a in a very shortened version of something. So um, this is why a lot of writers write on spec, uh, meaning speculation, meaning you write the script itself, because now everything that you want to say and all the little delicious bits and pieces. That you have that, that that you have in mind are there on the page. The frustration for me in a pitch is, you know, you, it's, it, at best they're ten minutes long, fifteen minutes long, because you just don't. The person a doesn't have time to listen to a long pitch, and plus people's attention spans are short. And so um, you want to you have to distill down this fabulous idea of, of yours into a really kind of short, exciting, short telling. And um, one of the the the, the Best ways to kind of dive into that and keep yourself on track as you kind of have this, you have your 110 page movie idea in, in mind and you're trying to distill it down into telling it in 10 minutes is if you, if you, if you um, go to the office in the morning or you go to school and somebody, and you'd say, Oh, gee, I saw this great movie last night. Or I went to the movies and I saw this great movie. And, you know, versus what's it about? You don't go into like a 15, 10, 15 minute description of what that movie was about. You've got, you tell them in like two seconds, you know, it's like, you know, it's, it's about these giant transformer robots that, that, that come to Earth and these other ones that have already been here and they've got this thing, you know, um, that they're trying to, you know, from their, from their culture that they're trying to save and it's really cool, you know. Now, that's an incredibly short telling of Transformers, I, or I hope it's what, clear that it was Transformers, but it's that sort of thing. So it's, it's in the business, in the movie business, they call it the, either the elevator pitch or the water cooler pitch, but it's essentially I call it the the elevator pitch, which is um, you if you were trying if somebody was about to get in the elevator and the doors were about to close, what would you tell them very quickly to get them to understand what the, what the idea is, you know, and and just, if you can distill it down that small, now you know the essence of what your story is, and now you can you can elaborate on that, um, and ten minutes can seem like a luxury because you're 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 simply adding you know, detail to something that's really that that short, um, and so it's. You say it's it really is a performance. You really have to go in energized and ready to kind of see, be enthusiastic about your idea, and even if there's parts of your idea that you know are a little rough, you know, you need to either be prepared to smooth over that or be prepared to, um, you know, uh, seem as enthusiastic about that part as you do about others. Um, and there's a lot of stuff you can leave for, for questions, too. I, I, I find that really effective. I need to know my story really well. And there may be things that I go, okay, there's this whole other side story with this character that I absolutely love, but I can't go into that in this pitch because it's not salient to the, the main thing. But often people will say, well, you know, what, that other character, what, okay, now what happens with him or what, you know. And now I've got... They've, they've opened the door, and plus I've got an answer, so I've got this kind of whole elaborate thing. So I find that really, that that helpful too. And it, 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 there's times that I leave a pitch and I'm frustrated because they didn't ask the question, and I didn't get a chance to tell them all this kind of other delicious stuff. But I had, I, you know, I'm leaving the room in, in 15 minutes, not, you know, an hour and a half later.